Hey guys, welcome to another video tutorial. Today we're going to crochet granny square number seven. So to start, we're going to take our thread and we're going to make a uh, slip knot. And then we are going to crochet four chain stitches. So we've got a chain of four. And we go back to the very first chain and we're just going to slip stitch. There we go. And I'll move my yarn over and we're just going to chain one. Now in the center, we're going to chain 12 single crochets. So it's just the little center of our chain circle we just made. It gets a little tight. So once you start getting to like single crochet number nine, you might have to move things over a little bit, but you can fit all 12 um, single crochets here. So I'll just keep stitching these and move them over. Okay, so now I'm just going to go into that very first stitch and we're going to slip stitch. And that is our first row. So now we chain one and we're going to keep chaining uh, six more stitches. So you're going to end up with a total of seven stitches. We're going to go back into this first little stitch at the very base of our chain and we're just going to single crochet. Then we chain two, skip two stitches, and single crochet in the third chain seven and then single crochet at the base of the chain chain two oh. okay then two skip two stitches and single crochet in the third chain seven single crochet at the base of the chain, chain two, skip two, and then we're going to single crochet and chain seven, and we just single crochet at the base of the chain, and then we chain two, and we're going to, we're going to slip stitch right here at the base of that first chain that we made. So I'll just pull the yarn through, there we go. And we slip stitch. There we go, that's row number two. So for the next row, we're gonna chain two, and then we're gonna make four double crochets in this little, the first little chain. So that's one, two, three, and our fourth double crochet and we chain three and then we make four more double crochets and when we're done with our double crochets we chain two and right in this little the chain two that we had made where we skipped two stitches we're going to single crochet then we chain two and then we go back into the next chain and we chain and we make, excuse me, uh, four double crochets. I have to grab a little more yarn. And then we chain three and make four more double crochets. And then we chain two and we single crochet at the base here in our uh, chain space. And we chain two and we make our four double crochets. And we're just going to keep working this for the last remaining two chains. So now when I'm done with this um, granny square, you're going to see that it's quite small. I am using two threads of fingering yarn. So I mean, essentially it's a size two yarn because each of them is just a size one yarn. Um, I did make this in a bigger using a thicker yarn, like a four, uh, like a size four yarn. And it's, it's significantly bigger. So the size of this granny square will depend on the thickness of your yarn. So the thicker your yarn, the bigger the granny square will be. 
So just keep that in mind when I show you the photo at the end of how these granny squares all look, because they are quite small in this yarn. So just keep working on this granny square. And then my double crochets. Oh no. The problem with working with two threads is sometimes you only use one. There we go. Three and four. And then we chain two. And in that little chain space, we're just going to slip stitch. And that's it. Our granny square is done. Hope you enjoyed the video tutorial. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Um, subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And follow us on Instagram at mode.bespoke. Thanks for watching.